My name is Jason Valderrama, and I'm a primary care physician assistant here at Sunrise Community Health Center in Loveland, Colorado. Uh, my training is in primary care, and I love getting to practice in a community health center model. If you think about it, the name really says it all. This is a center that's focused on providing health care to anyone and everyone that calls this community home. Sunrise really does an amazing job at being a center for health. Uh, when I think about uh, what we provide to the community, uh, it, it is really available to anyone and everyone, and it's a place where they can come and get medical needs met. Uh, there's really a comprehensive view of what it means to provide health care uh, to the community here. We're, we're equipped to treat the whole person. That means that we're set up to address medical needs, we're set up to address behavioral health needs, we're set up to, to take care of dental needs or pharmacy needs, and it's all on site for our patients. That's why I love being able to practice primary care in this setting. One of the things that we do in our medical training and that is really helpful in, in a learning environment is doing case studies. And we do case studies to uh, present an actual patient and talk about how we can treat that patient better and it helps us to learn. And what I'd like to do for you today is I'd like to do a case study of uh, a community health center patient here in Loveland, Colorado. So I would like you to, to picture uh, a new patient moving to Loveland and needing to establish primary care. They can come to our clinic and let's say they, they, they come in and they tell us we don't have any insurance. That's okay, that's no problem. We're gonna help you get uh, established with a primary care provider here today. Uh, during that interview, maybe we, we talk and they say, I haven't had access to dental care in a really long time and I think it's affecting some elements of my health. I, I don't feel well. And we say, no problem, we have dental on site. We're gonna get you set up with an appointment and scheduled for an appointment uh, before you even leave today. Uh, same is true of pharmacy. We have a pharmacy here on site and, and can help take care of medications while the patient is is here in the office. Uh, I think about uh, maybe uh, a patient telling me, I'm wrestling with depression, I've struggled with depression in the past, and, and moving to this new city uh, has really brought up some, some anxiety for me, and um, I'm feeling nervous, and, and I tell them, you know what, we have behavioral health here today, you can meet with a behavioral health counselor, and we can help develop a behavioral health plan to, to address all of these needs. And so that's a, that's a picture of, of what a community health center provides for our patients. And it's, it's why I love working in this environment. I also think about uh, patients' need for insurance and having enrollment specialists here on site to be able to, to work with them and look at um, their financial status and, and to be able to say, we have an insurance plan that we can help you get enrolled with. Uh, having those things under one roof is so helpful. Putting all of this together, you can start to see what a, what a benefit a community health center has to the patients uh, of, of any given area and, and all the needs that can be met in one home. Uh, as that patient is leaving and as that patient is establishing care, here's something that I would communicate to them is you can bring your whole family here. Bring grandparents. Uh, your friends are welcome. Bring your kids. Everybody in between. Um, we have a place here for you. This is a, a community health center that's for anyone and everyone in our community, and we are here for you. This is your center for health.